champion, Simon Yates, Jack Bauer, Luke Durbridge, Lucas Hamilton, Michael Hepburn, and Cameron Meyer. The team manager, Matthew White, Mitchell and Scott. Phil, before we get started down there, I'm over here. Hello, Phil. I'm Robbie. We'll be working together all week. Will we? You do the talk and I'll do the, well, the talk. I'll work with you. Well, you go it alone. We've got to have a quick chat to Cam. Ladies and gentlemen, the Australian national champion, Cameron Meyer. Cam, you've won nine world championships on the track, but I've never seen you so emotional about winning a race and now getting the chance to wear this beautiful jersey. Yeah, it was definitely a, a special moment on Sunday last week. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know, I fell in love with that race uh, a long time ago. I saw my brother win it, I saw many of my mates win it, and uh, it was one I def definitely uh, wanted to add to the Palmares, and it was uh, it was definitely special. Um, you've got that one now. Enjoy your week here in Australia, the, probably the only race you'll get here to wear that jersey before you fly away to Europe, so have a fantastic week. And everybody, make sure you cheer on our Australian champions. Well done, Cam. He's got all three road titles to his credit now. Simon, I've commentated on you for years. I don't think I've ever spoken to you in person. And you come from Bury as well, which is great. Yeah, a long way from there now. Uh, in very different conditions here. You and me both, mind you, sad about your football team, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, but what can you do? I think a lot of clubs are like that now. And, uh, yeah. See. Now the fact that you're here, the fact that this is an incredible team anyway, does that mean you're going to win again, Dan? <laughs> oh, well, the uh, idea is that uh, Mitchell and Scott wins, but uh, no, look, uh, it would uh, be great to do it uh, three times in a row and uh, prepare it as best as I can. And uh, love racing here in Australia and uh, I think uh, all the boys are here to, to give their best and uh, like you said, we've got a fantastic team. Um, Glass for every scenario, so uh, yeah, we've got plenty of cards to play and we'll be using them throughout the week. Now, you've won it twice, as you say. You're the first person to win two consecutive Santos Tour Down Under. Obviously, if you get three, that's going to put the record well up there. But the man you've beaten for the last two years was Richie Port, and on one of those victories, you were on zero seconds, so it was count back for you. So, you've got to watch Richie, haven't you? Oh, look, every every day counts here. It's, uh, there's no doubt going into a stage like Wollonga, I need a buff on Richie. Um, that's uh, for sure. So I've got a busy week. Um, the boys have got a busy week. And, uh, you know, like every year, we come here fighting and uh, we give it our best shot. It's an important race for us. And, uh, you know, we're racing uh, for our home sponsors and uh, for Australia. So uh, we give it our best shot. If I may say so, great wine as well. But uh, that's another question. Dal, the very best of luck to the team, the very best of luck, not just for now, of course, but for the season. Long year ahead, will you be champion of South Africa by March? Look, I uh, hope to uh, have the champion's jersey again. It's been fantastic to represent the country and, uh, you know, especially after last year, it was a fantastic year. And, uh, you know, if uh, I can't win by March, hopefully I'll uh, get one more chance to win in a jersey, yeah. And, of course, the Olympic Games as well, of course, to suit you. Uh, I don't know if it suits me yet, but uh, definitely the Olympics will be a, a great race to go to and uh, obviously represent the country as best I can. The best of luck and we're looking forward to a week of racing. Two-time winner the last two years, Dal Limpy and Team Mitchell and Scott.